Here's Roman Delizia at UFC 286. Uh, we spoke to Marvin a little earlier, and uh, I was I was asking him about this this situation that mm -hmm. uh, he was actually a little surprised, not in a in a bad way, but he was when this fight kind of got brought up to him, he was like, "Oh, really? Roman accepted the fight because." You guys are kind of friendly, I suppose. Was there any sort of hesitation on your part, I guess, taking this fight? I don't understand what does it mean because uh, it's opportunity, first of all, for me. I knew him, but nothing like more like I just see him a few times, that's all. Um, I don't think and uh, I know that he's a good guy and a uh, good opponent for me. And I don't understand why he says these things because he also accepted the fight. I don't yeah. understand what does that mean. Did you know that he was going to be coming to Las Vegas at the time yes. he took this fight? Yes, yes. It, it happened like that. Like, uh, I was planning to go to Thailand before fight. And I wasn't planning, yes, I wasn't planning to fight, Mar fight Marvin. I was asking other opponents. And uh, also, I knew that Marvin is going to train in extreme before fight. And it just happened like that. And we said, okay, it's, it is how it is. <laughs> I train in Thailand. He trains uh, uh, in extreme too. Does it make it awkward at all, knowing that he is in that room where so many people know you so well, and, and that's that it's kind of your home, and it's like now the enemy is, is in your home. Like, has it, has it been awkward at all? First of all, he's not my enemy. That's yeah. that from me. Second of all, it doesn't bother me at all, as it's fight, and I'm just trying to be professional and do my job, that's all. When this fight was announced, it was like, I think maybe it was even the first fight that was yeah. added to this card. Um, I've seen you say that you really want to sign a poster with your face on it. Did yeah. you think that when this fight got put on the London, that you be on the poster this one? I was thinking like that, but it is how it is. I will wait my chance. <laughs> yeah, there was no no uh, disappointment, I suppose, coming no, here. And of course, no. It's like I'm asking UFC to do this, to make this happen. But I will wait the time when it will be, it will happen. I will make them do this. Did you? Uh, does this does this fight feel? like a big one to you though like given the the, the rank and, and where it's at the pay-per-view card does it feel different than something all else? all fights are very important for me especially marvin fight he's high ranked opponent very good good skilled and a uh, good test for me also it's very good that he fought a lot of guys in top level and it's very good important fight for me but like i always say every fight is important when you look at marvin what has made him successful so far in the ufc no uh, he's well-rounded uh, good cardio um Good guy. Yeah, nothing more. What has held him back from, from maybe being the champion? What do you think no, has held him back? Every everyone have this uh, time when you are going up after step a little bit back. It just matter of time who will be on top. I don't know what's happened with him. I thought that he could uh, easily win, uh, easy fight like, uh, especially second one. Uh, but it, it it is how it is. No, you don't know what plan, what what's planning for you in future. Do you feel like uh, the way in some of which you're finishing some of these fights, we call you like a dangerous guy, right? Who do called you, me dangerous? <laughs> I think a lot of people do. A lot of people do. Your style is looked yeah. at as, hey, when he gets a chance, he takes advantage of it. He finishes it. Do you think that that impacts some of the way that uh, your opponents face you, just knowing that you have that, that danger factor? You know, you need to understand one thing. I don't really care impact them or not impact. I don't really care what they say, they, they don't say. I'm just doing what I want to do. I'm trying to be myself. I'm trying to be Roman Dolidze there. That's main thing what I'm trying to do. Always people ask me, what's your game plan for a fight? I never had game plan. Does someone can make game plan to make, make cow slicer? Or like to win Phil Hose uh, do a leg lock after let him go and after do knockout or Kyle Dakas needed from this I don't know how to explain it in this position. No, it is how it's happening. I'm just going there and I'm just myself. Do you think beating Marvin Vittori will that validate something or prove something to yourself? Or you already you already know? Or what that can prove me? I'm Roman Dolidze, Marvin, other guys, whoever will be there. It's first of all who I am. I don't care what other people think. Do you, uh, I mean, obviously your focus is completely on, on Marvin. You no, don't worry. You can ask that question <laughs> what you want. Well, you called out Hamza Shemaev uh, yeah. after your last fight. Yeah. Is he still on your mind? Is it just that that's an important fight for you? I want to fight uh, best uh, guys in this sport. Uh, Chimaev, uh, you know, when I'm saying someone's name or even with Marvin, uh, I'm grateful that they gave me such a good opponent. I respect him, respect him like a sportsman, like a fighter. The same with Chimaev. Chimaev is for me like one of the best athletes in this sport. And fighting him, it was honor for me. Like I want to try myself with the best in this division. That's all. It wasn't like I want to prove myself something. No, I just want to be best in, with, in the best. 
because you can be champion with sheep, but I want to be champion with lions. Mm -hmm. So last question, uh, in your division, obviously there's a title fight coming up. Who do you think will, will, will win that fight and who do you think you'll be facing when you get there? That's a very interesting fight because uh, Izzy was winning all three times and he lost at the end. And that's why I still think that Izzy can win this fight. But do you see what this guy is doing at, I don't know, 50-50? Yeah. Well, I'm looking forward to it, man. Best of luck on Saturday. Thank you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.